Hi all. So welcome to my third tutorial on HTML CDs. So in this tutorial, we will be discussing about the HTML text formatting tags. So we are having these tags. So, so B means bold, I means italic, strong is strong, EM is emphasized, mark is mark, small is small, del is deleted, and IN is just inserted. So basically, these denote the formatting of text. Okay, so before we start with the formatting of tags, I would like to uh, talk about comments. So in HTML, uh, like any other languages, we will be having certain uh, process for commenting it. So in HTML, we comment in this fashion. So I have written this text formatting tags as a comment. So what does actually comment is, uh, it is a portion anything which you comment it will not be displayed on the web browser it will not be on the output screen so why do we use uh, comments is for proper indentation and proper understanding so as a beginner we need to use as much as comments as possible because we need to understand what we are doing okay so this is how the commenting is done in html so let's now start with the each and every formatting tags so B is nothing but bold. Suppose you want your text to be bold, so you can you can uh, write in this tag. Okay. So how do you write is suppose I want certain text to be in bold, so I'll just open the bold tag, I'll write the text, and then I'll close the bold tag. So how do I do it? Let's say I want to print um, about HTML. Let's say HTML is a So this text, I want it to be bold. So what I'll do is I'll just start with the bold tag, write the text, and then I will close the bold tag. Okay, so this is how this text will be displayed completely in bold. Suppose I want certain uh, words or certain uh, sentences to be italic, so I, I can provide an I tag, that is italic tag. Suppose I want to provide my name, I want it to be in italic, so I'll just open the i tag and i'll just close the i tag okay it's very simple coming to strong strong is again uh, a new version of bold so in bold basically you bold the text strong means the same thing but it varies in a little bit a color or uh, size so let's say I, in strong tag i want to display certain certain line and then you can close the strong tag. Emphasize is nothing but it, the text will be emphasized in a way. Okay, all are formatting tags. So there is, you'll be, you'll be having slight difference between each and every tag. So emphasize, suppose I would, I want to write regarding HTML itself. HTML was founded by Tim Berner. Okay, next is mark. Suppose I want to highlight a particular word or particular line, so I need to use this mark tag. So basically that, that word or that line will be marked. So suppose I want to mark HTML in a line. So I'll start in this way. HTML new version is so the new version of HTML is the latest version of HTML5. So I want to mark that HTML5. It, I want it to be highlighted. So I need to open the mark tag and write HTML5. And then I need to close this mark tag. So you'll see the difference. Next, uh, something I just want to display it in a smaller version of text. So I, I can write it in smaller version. So let's write HTML in small version. Uh, next is I want to delete something and I want to insert something. So both can be done at a time. Okay, how, you, how you'll do is, I'll show you. So my name is 
Katyusha. Okay, but I want to delete my name and I want to insert some other name. So what I'll do is I'll use the del tag against my name and then I'll close the del tag. And now I will use the insert tag to insert one more name, let's say Sania, and I will close the insert tag. So there's a difference. Okay. Uh, next, other than these, uh, so let's just execute these so that we'll just understand it. So one more thing is the head tag and the title tag is completely optional, but HTML and body are mandatory because without body and HTML, nothing will be, nothing works in the uh, web browser. Okay. So just close it with body and HTML and just save it. So I have already saved it as second.html. So control S, go to your, uh, so it's here. So this is how. So basically it, everything got displayed in single line. I don't want like this. I want it to be in a proper indentation way. So I will be using the BR tag. So BR tag is basically used for single line break, right? So I will use BR so that everything will be in a proper uh, format and it would be easy for me to identify it also. Okay. Yes. So just control S and now just refresh it. So this is how you got it. So let's now see the difference. So just keep your text, uh, your note, notepad uh, against you so that we'll get the difference between both. So the first was regarding the bold tag. So bold, you, know, you, you have seen HTML, full form is hypertext markup language. So that got displayed in bold. Then I wanted my name to print in italic. It got printed in italic. Then I wanted it to be strong. So it displayed in strong format. Next is I wanted to display in emphasized. HTML was founded by Tim Bernoulli. So it, the text is emphasized. Uh, next is I wanted to use the mark tag and I wanted to mark the HTML5 is the new version. So that got marked. Okay, so it got highlighted. So by default, it is yellow. My browser, I mean, the Edge browser is supporting yellow highlight, uh, yellow color as the highlighter. So it got displayed in that. Uh, next is I wanted to display in a smaller format, so it got displayed. Next, I wanted to delete my name and I wanted to insert a new name that is Sanya. So that is how it got displayed. Okay, so this is how the text formatting is done. So other than these, we are having other two tags which are mostly used in uh, mathematical operations like the sup and sup. So what is the sup and sup is? So basically it is uh, subscript and superscript. Subscript means it will be below the variable and superscript means it will be above. Okay, so subscript and one more is superscript. Okay, so sub is suppose I want to write a n like log n, right? So log will be at the top and sub will be n. So I'll keep that n in the enclosed in sub. Okay, and soup is basically used for uh, any cubical operation or any square, like exponential uh, operations, right? So suppose I want to write a cube. So what I'll do, a will be at the bottom and super, super is nothing but superscript. It will be about the text. So I want it to be cube. So I'll write three and then close it in this fashion. Okay, just save it and just, refresh it. So you can see log n uh, is the subscript and a cube is done by the superscript. So this is how the formatting of tags are done. So this is called as text formatting tags. Mostly we will be using according to the, according to what we are designing in the web browser. So this was the third tutorial. So 
uh, stay tuned for for the next tutorial so till then bye